Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome to Fett Plays The Darkest Dungeon Season 3. Let's go, baby. That's right. New mod list, new save. Welcome to the 69th estate. It's pretty nice. Uh, not going to look at the mod list here. I'm going to jump right in in just a minute. Just to let you know, I did test the mod list, so I know that the saves load. I got a couple weeks in just to play with it. So, as far as I know, there are no huge problems with this mod list as of right now. We'll see if that changes in the future. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and load the save. You can also see that it's on Blood Moon, which means it's more difficult. I did get a mod that will give me extra time, a lot of extra time and extra deaths before a game over that I don't plan on hitting, for obvious, obviously. But the game is going to be harder, and that's kind of the point, because uh, you've seen the end game in Seasons 1 and 2, or if you haven't, go check it out. It gets a little ridiculous. So without further ado, let's jump into the 69th estate. I will never skip this intro, just letting you know. It is too good. Back to the old road. You will arrive along the old road. It winds with a troubling, serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside. Leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient, pitted cobbles of the old road. And Very on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and Thugs. perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. Ghost! So steal yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. I still get chills watching that. I can't believe it. I, like, I just felt it, felt it right there at the end. I felt it, too. Uh, <laughs> Man, that is a good intro. The old road with the stagecoach destroyed, the caretaker gone, you'll have to make the journey to the hamlet on foot. Or so you say. Thank you for your support, the caretaker. Just F's off as soon as we, uh, as soon as we crash. You know, there's a treasure chest there. Is that supposed to be the one that we find later? I don't know. I I'm assuming you're building out the save right now because there's so many mods. I didn't count them. I should have given you the count. Dang it. That would have been nice. I don't know, maybe it'll be in the thumbnail or something. Or maybe it won't. I'll probably forget that I said that. You know how it is. You know how it is. I say things and then I don't do it. It's a hallmark of this channel. <laughs> but I will get through season three. And we will have a good time. In theory. I mean, come on. Let's go. Let's go. There are no heirs this time, by the way. Well, not entirely true, but there's no heirs with us to start off uh, on the old road. There it is. Woo, boy. That was a heck of a thing. Map navigation. You're currently in a room. Pretty great. We know this, but thank you. Thank you for the support. Uh, there they are. Good old Reynold and Dismas uh, choosing their uh, gray sportswear today. Very nice. Very nice. All right, so we do have a couple of differences right off the bat, which you probably have noticed. Uh, while we and you can't get that treasure chest though, huh? While we're waltzing around, run up these lanes. thank you, Keep Manchester. Well, okay, boy, settle down. While we're waltzing, just point out some of the differences we have right away. Hello, Brigand. How's life? Hopefully it's pretty hard. Kill the enemy! Uh, you don't mind if I do. Um, icons in the bottom left and right were actually a uh, fan art made by Vasilla for Darkest Dungeon Season 1? Or maybe even before that. It might have been from the streams. I honestly don't remember at this point. Give him a cut. Thank you, my friend. There it is. And you might notice some differences in the moves, which we do have, actually. Smite is actually not any different, but all of the vanilla characters have been redone in a way. Zealous Accusation gives everyone protection. Stunning Blow, extra damage gets on Holy. Actually, uh, Accusation has that too. Bulwark of Faith activates a slapback, and I love it. Why has Reynold not had a slapback this whole time? I have no idea. Hit me. He's gonna hit both of them. 
No, he's not. He's gonna be even worse. God dang it. You try to frick around on the very first level and they scream. There you go. Shake me, bro. It's what you get. I love it. Them all. I love it. Uh, something else you might notice. Hey, hey, I'm not talking to you. I know what you do, interactive object. Transcendent Terror will just go ahead and give us a stress break right away, and I'm gonna pass on that crap. Couple other things you might notice. Gold. Hey, look, we got three three uh, levels here. That's right. The rightful owner has returned. Thanks. Kind is no longer welcome. Very cool. We've got more uh, item slots than ever. That also counts for trinkets down here too. This whole thing is for trinkets now. You notice that the equipment doesn't show here. It still shows here though. You can still see it. But uh, yeah, uh, we are ready. And Reynolds ready to slap back. Golly, I love slap back strats so much. Hit me. That's what you get. You have 41 health at level zero? God dang. Nice shot, Dismas. Let's get these guys out of here. Oh, slap back kill. There it is. Advantage. Give them no quarter. We are hot and heavy and early with the slap backs, and I am here for it, dude. Give me a stun. There you go. A stunny stun stun for the big boy. Now the question is, do we bleed him? Use a two for three. Ooh, and it lowers bleed resist too. Also lowers speed, which is not as useful. Uh, oh, it also does like, well, okay. It doesn't do much, as much damage as the regular shot. Also the regular shot gets a 10% crit boost. Like what the hell? Bleed him. Bleed him. Oh no. Well, now at least he has no bleed resist. We know it'll work next time. All right, Reynolds been punished. Thank. Give him a thwack. Get this boy out of here. I want to go back to the Hamlet and take a look around. Now give me that bleed. Yeah, you're not resi resisting it with a bleed resist of zero. All right, next turn, he's out of this house. What are you going to do, point blank me? Nope, he's going to whip. He's going to whip it good. Ow. Minor case of the stress. We're still okay, though. Get slashed. Slashed and dashed. The sharpened blade. The blood! That was early. Hi, blood. How you doing? And we've completed a quest. Look. It's trapped chest. It's trapped! It's like it warned me. Alright, let's get out of here. What else is new? This screen loads a lot faster, which I actually love. I cannot wait to see, like, 40 items on that line. All just, you know, clinging and dinging one after the other. It's gonna sound so cathartic. I'm already in love with it, and I'm just thinking about it. Steady. Hey! Minus stress for Ray Ray. That's a nice start. Never ask a man what his business business is, for it never interests me. Alright, new load screen stuff. Futile struggle or penance for my unspeakable transgressions. Thanks. Um, the loading screen itself, they, they're new ones, and they look great, by the way. Uh, Deus Ex Machina. Looks like we got the Salamander back already. Corbett, over here. Joining the estate right away. Technology. An engine of destruction. All right. Graveyard. Most it exists. Up here, covered in the poisoned earth, awaiting merciful oblivion. Uh, I hope not, Ancestor. We only get 48 deaths. It's a lot less than vanilla. I know it's like, uh, I think four times less, like 12 deaths, I want to say, is your limit. We got a lot more. I mean, it is the 69th estate, so, uh, you know, I wanted a nicer time. Uh, and I believe we get, like, 900 weeks. We get plenty of weeks. I want to play the game, okay? I don't want to run up against deadlines. If I wanted to do that, I'd go back to work. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. All right. Got our Plague Doctor time, and Vestal, of course. We'll know the tragic extent of my failings. Plague Doctor, Marisco, Noxious Blast, Plague Grenade actually seem very strong early on, so I don't know how that's going to change. Uh, what else you got? Battlefield Medicine, Cure Blight and Bleed and Heal, that's normal. And uh, Disorienting Blast, Stun, nice. Clear Enemy Corpses, Shuffle, neat. Enter the air, our, hero, our healer, healer hero, I don't know, she's roguish apparently. Trap Disarm Chance, <laughs> from 0 to 15. Uh... Actually, 55% chance base. Nice. Uh, Mace Bash. It has a, it has a knockback. Ups the torch. 
Ups healing received for everyone else. Judgment ups healing received for everyone else. Almost all of her moves up torch, which is interesting. Uh, Divine Grace, two to four heal. And Illumination, this is a huge change. It's no longer an attack. It is a buff. It is a 40% damage buff with 20 protection to accuracy. This seems a little ridiculous, I'm not going to lie. Um, but that said, you know, you buff you, you absorb hits and do slapbacks, everybody has a good time, I guess. Nomad Wagon, how you doing? The hell is that? Gathered from all the forgotten hmm. corners of the earth. Apparently there's an in inviation, I think it's supposed to be invitation, to the Midnight Ball for the Count. Extra HP, neat. The Jeweler is here. This free? Hand of the Outsider for the Divinity. Disables guarding skills, no dodge. But 200% damage reflection. I'll take a free trinket, I don't freaking care. Uh, these are Ringmaster trinkets. Nice. I mean, someday. <laughs> not today, though. 100,000 cost. We ain't there. We're not there yet. All right. Let's go on another one. A mecca of madness and morbidity. Mm -hmm. Your work begins. Thanks. As you can see, plenty of other changes. Got the ruins over here. We got the wheel down here. Look at that. The Banshee's already here in the wheel. Got the Hamlet down here. Freaking uh, Rift Dungeon's already here and ready to go. Got the arena sitting down in the corner. Very cool. Very cool. Got some puppets. It's great. But, of course, we're going to start with our scout mission. As you do. Let's take the usual suspects out for a spin. All right. The cost of preparedness measured now in gold, later in blood. All right, we're going to pack relatively light. I think this is good. Hey, I'll take a key just in case. Yeah, this isn't perfect, but it it's fine. It's fine. I'm not going to complain. Your first expedition into the ruins of your ancestry. Be curious. Be careful. Very cool loading screen. Yeah. So you can already see there's plenty of changes, plenty of differences. I can't wait to see the other vanilla classes and what changes have been brought to the table for them. Vestal seems really strong. Not going to lie. But, you know, maybe I'm being bamboozled. I'm just happy Raynald can slap back. That's so fun. Everyone should have a slap back move. I declare it here. That's my one wish. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Bank. Paid for in blood. All right, the good old... Hey, wow, you're new already. Eroded ruler statues. There's four of them, as you can see. I guess we'll use this uh, blight chance for four damage for five rounds, please. Fuck. I mean, frick. Well, that's... Did not take long to get the first F-bomb of the season. Damn it. <laughs> that, was, that was too fast. That was my mistake. They all have 10% protection, by the way. I feel like these these mighty lasses, lads, I can't tell, uh, are going to do some weird stuff. Let's find out. Some nice stoneworks. Declare outlaw. No, that's the guy behind me. Stop. Lowers dodge. Okay. Declare outlaw. No, that's the, that's the guy in front of me. Stop. Oh, it marks, too. Royal's rage. All right, that's just a regular attack. Royal decree. That's a heal, isn't it? It gives an extra move? I mean, it didn't work in your favor, but still, what the heck? Destroy them all. Okay. These lads are already a little, a little, a little extra tricky. Wow, Marisco, you are not putting in the performance that I'm looking for here today. It's a little disappointing so far. How long does that uh, buff last, by the way? Two rounds, it looks like, because we got one round left of all this. As the fiend falls. It's all we needed. It's how long the slapback lasts, too. So, kind of works out. All right. Mirsko, we got this. I, I mean, I'm happy you feel good about it. I love cheerful, by the way. Fantastic uh, trait. Can we? Can I get a crumb of blight, please? Oh, well, I got a crumb of it. I got one. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, give me some heals. Uh, I forgot how weak early game healing is. Boom, baby! Get out the way. That's... that's She's down. Cool. Uh, can you, like, get rid of these quickly? Nah, not really, but you can get rid of these over time. 
Cool. Is the weapon that cuts on its own. Just one royal to go. Ow! That hurt. <laughs> Did not appreciate that. All right. Uh, let's. Dang! I was gonna say let's get this bread or kill. That really meant kill. But I'll take kill bread. Yo, there's a slap, and next turn's last turn. Don't throw it. Stop! Okay, now we're gonna go on a heel turn. Dismiss, please. Uh, okay. There you go. Is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Reynold, are you joking me? Going faster than our resident Vestal? Come on now, it's a speed of four! I'm telling you, speed stat, man, it means nothing. Never has, never will. Unforgiving. Just waiting for the for someone to eventually get get tired of me saying that. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Got a big old rant in the comments about how useful the speech Even that is. The cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. I know it does stuff, I swear. What the heck? Lustrous Seraph. Blessing of Stone. The Extra protection until... Huh. Got rid of all of our stress, too. So obviously these are from the Stonework mod, which is a mod. Brilliant job, that. Uh, but yeah, I didn't know we'd receive that that quickly. That's supposed to be a really rare encounter. <laughs> so rare we caught it on the very first. Oh god, dang it, Reynold. A fortune waiting to be spent. Our daily bread. Don't mind if I do. Uh, you know. I did get a mod that gives all of the uh, vanilla characters more lines, and so far, they've been pretty good. I like it. They, they're trying to give them more care. What the heck? <laughs> I like how the I like how the executioner's bellies float, um, and judges in the back. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. I realize you've not sent me a jury. I don't know if that's in, on purpose or not, but uh, I'm guessing the two in the back do marks. Yup. Oh god, that's worse! Oh, that's a hell of a lot worse than a mark. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Holy crap, and there's two of them? What? Extra damage against marked. Okay, that's that's what I expected to see. I expected to see marks. Jacques! Is that an all-team mark? No, okay. Extra damage received, that's worse. That's worse. Dude, you are, like, terrible with these blights. I mean, I get it's a 50% chance, but can I win 50% of the time, please? I'd appreciate that. The promise of safety. Okay, that one's dead. Silence. that just damage? Yeah, apparently. Um, we have a chance to stun one of these? I'm gonna go for it. Uh, this mission is not going well. That death sentence is horrendous. It's not death sentence, it's prison sentence, but... Execute the guilty. I'm guessing that if you were marked, that would do a ton more damage. Dude, come on! <laughs> what the hell? Facing the abyss. Like, these assholes ha are having no mercy with the health damage. Which... I don't know, in my experience, the health damage is way worse than the stress damage at lower levels. M wow! The true test. Good the lord, man! Expire. And these guys have 20-something health to start with. There it is! Thank you, Decimus. Maintain the offensive. Makes our back line a little safer. In fact, our back line is safe for right this minute. Safe fish. You know what I mean. Great damage. Oh, Marisco, you can get the kill. Press this advantage. Ha ha! No quarter. Suck it! Ow! 
<laughs> My face! The very precipice of oblivion. Well, we're not going to bleed the statue, but he can still cut it. And that does technically lower bleed resist. I can't wait to see that pay off. It, it's not going to pay off, in case you were wondering. Um, blight it, please. Please, please, please. Okay, now at least the two in the back can focus on healing. And you're dead in three turns, so maybe that's what we do from now on. Nice dodge, Reynold. That was worth a lot. Uh, stun? You're dead in this turn. Also, there's the fact that you can't move. Okay. The scary part is we probably have at least one more battle before we're done. Just because of the uh, the way the first dungeon is formatted. Slowly. So this is a little terrifying. This is how a life is taken. Thanks. I mean, at least we're getting plenty of crap. <laughs> Okay, I'm guessing the best trap disarm chance is still on Dismas. 90, 50, 60, 55. Our boy has done it. Alright. Give me a scout, please. Uh, <laughs> Alright, we're going to play it a little safe here. I'm going to give everyone two food. Alright. For the cause. Oh, yes, of course. Take more of my stuff. Oh, jeez. Ten food? I don't... Okay. I, I can't verify this in any way. But I genuinely believe that items like that drop extra food and consumables. Or no, just extra stuff in general when a Kleptomaniac opens it. Because I they almost never do that and it's empty. In, in my experience. They've almost never, like, opened it and found out that it's actually empty. Now, I could be totally wrong. I could be talking out my butt. Wouldn't be the first time, but... Yeah, it could also just be, you know... A bias. My own confirmations. Coming at me. Hot and heavy. Alright. Out of food. We don't need it. We're at the end. It is more freaking statues! Dang it! We got maidens in the back. We did get a surprise, which mm, could be nice. Please double blight. Just single blight. I'll take it. I'll take a single blight over, uh, you know, no blight. All right, Ray Ray. Uh, you know what? Get ready. I don't know what the sentries are going to do. I must. They might guard. They're going to retaliate. Against who? We. Okay, they get slapbacks. But they get slapbacks at less damage and less. or extra crit chance. Interesting. Mood light. Oh, that feels like a. Oh, that took my light! Okay, it took my torch. Tough as diamond. Alright. Power fist. Dodge protection up. Okay, don't attack them. Gotcha. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Neat. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Come on, Marisco. Jeez, she is goofing it hard, man. Buff him again. Yes, hit me first. Boom, baby. I'm gonna get you out of this house. Hit me! Alright, reprimand. Reprimand that! <laughs> Hell yeah, Ray Ray. Give me the uh, zealous accusation. One damage on the slapback. Extra stress gain. That sucks, but still. Ooh! Oh ho 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 ho! Dismiss coming hot and heavy with the skills as well. Paying them bills. As the light gains purchase. Yeah, out of my oh frick. That purpose is made clear. Ah, you Philistine! Nope. Reynolds not ready with the slap back. That's okay. He has a piece of paper and it says you suck. Beautiful. Seize this momentum. Use the key. Push on to the task's end. Fantastic! Not bad for a first quest. I mean, we got a lot of stress on Marisco here, but to be fair, Marisco kind of performed like garbage. So, uh, you kind of deserve it. Yeah, that just feels good. Watching that load faster feels so good. And I hated clicking down here because it made everything load immediately, and it just didn't feel as good. This feels good. It's the little things, you know? All right, good job, team. Quick-witted. 
Extra speed and crit in position two. That's an that's a weird one. Farmstead Explorer. Luminous! Reynold with all the amazing traits! Yo! Dude, I'm just, just gonna... Oh no! It, wow, it crashed after the first mission. That was unexpected. Season 1 off to a great start. It did not do this on the other save. Which has me wondering if that was just a weird freak crash. We're gonna find out. We're gonna try to load back in. But uh, already, yeah, it's... I was gonna say, how how many how many episodes do you think before we get a crash? I think that was just that was probably just a one-time thing, would be my guess. But we're gonna find out. It says week two. It's loading the Hamlet. Yeah, it was just a weird freak thing. I think oldest and strongest emotion of mankind is fear, and the oldest and strongest kind of fear is fear of the unknown. I'm deep, and this is twelve. Uh, anyway. <laughs> So, we're gonna see, well, first we have to see if it loads. You know, let's not, let's not talk too much too quickly. Uh, this is genuinely the, of course it's while I'm recording the first one, are but. Pitched. Banners fly, and the corpse wagons stand at the ready. I wonder the if it was, has come to town. I wonder if it's because too much was changing in one episode, or in one, uh, one week. I don't know, but that was weird. Like I said, last one, the test uh, save went five weeks with no crashes, no nothing. As soon as I hit record, you gotta do this to me, Dark. It's, it's fine. We'll get past it. I really think it was just a single occurrence. Probably won't happen too much in the future. If it does, I'll work through it because I don't think there's anything too wrong with this mod list. I think it was just a weird accident. The anyway. Dusted, the pews set straight. The Abbey calls to the faithful. You son of a bitch you genuine ass fresh kegs cards and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and broken alike mm, cold blood ashes for the powder keg and a sturdy whetstone for the janissary or janissary is it janissary or janissary i don't know it depends on how you want to say it i guess two new uh class seer grave robber that uh, new in quotes <laughs> Gold gleams like a dagger's point. And an actual new class, the Duelist. All right, Ackroyd, what you got? Um, flashing daggers. Ooh, gives yourself a damage buff. Very good crit chance, too, but you're also a pessimist, which I really don't like. Uh, Shadow Fade. Double stun? Excuse me? Thrown dagger, ups accuracy, extra damage gets marked. Okay. And poison darts, which is still looks fantastic. The vanilla looked fantastic. This one still looks fantastic. You're new, though. Hello, Duelist. You look pretty awesome, I gotta say. Blade from the blue. Moves forward. Extra damage if the torch is low. Even more damage if stealth, which I assume means he has a stealth mechanic uh, built in somewhere. Disarm. Lower ac... That's a huge accuracy crit and damage debuff. Debuff lasts one round at 100% base chance. I don't know what that part means, necessarily. I, maybe it's just to say that it lasts one round. Which I had guessed, but alright. Um, slice, which is a bleed, and unguard, which guards an ally and ups dodge. He does have a slap back. Huge damage debuff on it. Backpedal. So, oh, there it is. Stealth. Okay, backpedal has stealth on it. Okay. So that can work with Blade from the Blue. Gotcha, gotcha. Good to know, good to know. Anyway, that is going to be for this episode of, of That Plays the Darkest Dungeon. Feel free to have fun with the fact that it crashed already. Yo, I rename these characters sometimes. If you want to see yourself in here, let me know in the comment section or leave a comment on Discord. I'm going to be completely honest and frank with you. People on the Discord are easier to track with their names. There's a link to that in the description below. I'm 99% sure. Uh, and uh, you might be able to see your own hero in here having some fun, having a good time. Obviously, I'm not going to re rename Reynold or Dismas, and there are some other characters who I want to see back in here as well, but uh, there should be plenty of room for plenty of people is what I'm trying to get at. Thanks for watching this episode of Fat Plays, The Darkest Dungeon Season 3. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know. Give it a like, if you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more, because it'll keep coming. It won't stop coming, not until it's over. Thanks for watching this episode. My name is Fat, and I will see you in the next video.